Hello learners, welcome to Easy Elimu Learning Simplified. My name is teacher Jonathan. And to start, I'll pose a question. How can you change position? How can you change position? For more on this, join me in our today's lesson for grade four, mathematics on geometry, position and direction. And today we'll be looking at clockwise and anticlockwise turns clockwise and anticlockwise turns now in our pairs we have our clock face here with me we have our clock face here now after you've learned carefully on this clock face we said it has a long minute and and a shorter our and now in our groups can you try to rotate the minute and towards the right. Rotate the minute and towards the right. We are working in our groups. Rotate the minute and towards the right. How will you know this is a minute and? It is the longer one. So move it towards the right. It will move towards the right. It is moving towards the right. It is moving towards the right. Have you seen so? We can repeat it again. We can repeat. We can repeat. Our minute and was there. The longer one. We want to move it towards the right. Moving it towards the right. So as it moves, it goes this side. Remember, if you were done the first time, do not repeat. Give your partner to do it also. Move it to the right. Continue moving it to the right. It is rotating, but to the right, it is rotating. But to the right, it is rotating, but to the right. We are using the only minute ant, and it has come back to its original position. This movement to the right is the one we call clockwise turns. It is the clockwise movement. Clockwise movement. Movement. Movement of the clock and to the right. Right is called clockwise movement. It is called clockwise movement or clockwise turn. It is called the clockwise movement or the clockwise turn. Why am I calling it the clockwise? Because it is turning. It is turning. So, in other words, what have you deduced from this little activity we have done in our groups? What have you learned from the activity that we have learned? Yes, I'll start with John. John, what have you learned? You have learned that the hands of a clock always turns to the right. And that movement towards the right is the one we have called clockwise turn. The, the hands of the year two of them, the hand of a clock, it moves towards the right. This movement are turns and it is turning to the right. That turn is the one we have called clockwise turn clockwise turn. Now, let us try another one. Let us try another one. Now, again, in the original position, again in our groups, remember we are working as a group work. So, if you have done it the first, give now the other partner who has not done it to do it. And now, we are moving it to the right. Now, we want to move it to the left. We are moving it to the left. To the left is the movement we are moving it towards, to the left. As you turn this minute and to the left, this movement to the left, it is against the way clock goes. It is against because we have said, John has told us, clock, hands of the clock always moves towards the right. But now our movement or our turn we are making is now against the movement of the clock. So, that against movement 
we call it anti-clockwise movement. That movement against the outlook goes is the one we are calling anti-clockwise movement. So movement to the this one was the movement to the right, and the other one is movement to the right, left. Movement of clock and to the left is the one we have called is called anti clockwise anti clockwise movement or turn it is going against the way clock normally goes so this turn is anti clockwise it is against how clock goes. Now, that is, we have observed that one from our clock face. Move towards the left of our clock, or our clock hand. The clock hands moving towards the left. We call it anti-clockwise turn or movement. But movement towards the right, we call it clockwise movement or clockwise turn. Now, learners, I would like us to take our bottle. We had a bottle with a lid. Take it, put it at your table. Remember the bottle as a lid. Now, I would like to see you learners in your group turning the lid clockwise. Turning the lid clockwise. Remember we have said all clockwise turn moves to the right. So make sure as you turn or as you turn your lead to in a clockwise movement it should go towards the right so this is towards the right so let us try to open the bottle first let us open the bottle let us open the bottle i've opened my bottle you have also opened yours let us close or close again the bottle we are closing the bottle we have replaced the lid i have done two things again let us repeat open the bottle we have removed the lid let us close the bottle again now my question is among the two exercises we have done let me write them here among the two exercises we have done opening the bottle lid opening bottle lid Opening bottle lid and closing bottle lid. Bottle lid. These are the two exercises we have done. And we can repeat them once more before now I ask my question. Open the bottle. The lid is out. Return the lid and close. I've closed my bottle. Now, out of the two exercises we have done, opening the bottle and closing the bottle, which one took the clockwise turn? Which one took the anti-clockwise turn? Learners, we have done that experiment with you. Now, who will answer us? Victoria, which one is the clockwise turn? Out of the two, if you are not sure, you can try to open it again or can close it. Try to open and close it. You can try to open it. Try to open and try to close, try to open, try to close, try to open, try to close. Which one is the clockwise turn? Victoria, closing of the lid is the clockwise turn. Correct, correct, closing, we are closing. Closing is the clockwise turn, that is correct. So this is a clockwise turn, clockwise, turn, and what about you, Jen? The opening of the lid is in which direction? Let us open. We see it is going to the left. It is going to the left. So it is the anti-clockwise. 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 Correct. Another task I would like you to do. Another task I would like you to do. Try to open the door of our class.
try to open the door of our class try to open the door of our class and close it you've opened group at a turn after the first one the second one can open now among us the two opening the door opening the door and closing the door opening the door and closing the door which one is the clockwise turn which one is the anti-clockwise turn remember we are opening the door is coming this side we are closing it it is going to the other side so which one is the clockwise turn opening the door is the clockwise turn while closing the door is the anti-clockwise turn that is very good now learners you can observe other ways as you do the practice in our homes how we turn clockwise or anti-clockwise remember that is an activity you have to do at home you do observe as you open the refrigerator as you close it as you open the window as you close it as you open the closets where you keep your clothes and you close it which one is the opening is the clockwise turns and anti-clockwise turn but before i conclude kindly work out the following task our task for the day or our, the exercise for the day tell whether clockwise or anti-clockwise tell whether clockwise or anti-clockwise clockwise or whether clockwise or anti-clockwise or anti-clockwise what are you telling is clockwise or anti-clockwise number one you are telling whether it is clockwise or anti-clockwise closing a tab closing a tab at the tank the top of a tank is it clockwise or anti-clockwise number two number two opening opening the window the window as you open the window is it clockwise turn or anti-clockwise turn these two will help you understand more on clockwise and anti-clockwise turn remember i've said when you go home you can try to teach or to understand better with the help of your parents tell them which one is the clockwise turn which one is anti-clockwise turn as they try to open the water as try to close the water tap which one is clockwise and which one is anti-clockwise this is the end of our lesson for today